Hey everybody, it's Antonio and welcome to Back at the Ranch. So we got something a little bit different for you today. Check this out. All right, so what we got here is something new from Walmart. Actually something I've never seen before, Swiss Tech. New brand, apparently they've been carrying this for a few months now. And uh, let me tell you, I was pretty impressed when I saw this in, in the display case. So I saw the display case and basically said, hey, let me take a look at that grabbed it and said, okay, I've got to have this one. So you know me, I don't buy very expensive knives, although I do have a couple of high-end knives, but this one right here, $29.99, talk about budget friendly. This might become an everyday carry and you'll see why in a minute. Excuse me if I say it wrong. Grundent, my understanding is that actually means round or rounded. Makes perfect sense because it does have rounded ends. So it is a flipper knife. Uh, this one's supposed to be assisted. We'll see, haven't opened it, haven't messed with it yet. But check out that box. Pretty cool, it says limited lifetime warranty. Got their website, actually a website's over here on this side. Is it a website? No, that's just a help desk uh, email, right? So got some information here at the bottom. What does it say here? It says seamless, streamlined, and strong. The Grundig combines ultimate compatibility with beautiful timeless design. Fall in love with the curves and stay for the cutting edge quality. Talk about a sales pitch right there, right? <laughs> so pretty much everything that's said in the front is right here. Apparently it comes with a lanyard as well, uh, or it says lanyard hole. We'll see if it actually has a lanyard, it is pictured. Actually it's right there as well. Reflective flick, lanyard cord, minimum and elegant streamlined design, which we already read that, and low profile, low profile back flipper, which of course that would be in the front. Uh, when it's not flipped. So let's check it out. So again, very nice box. Um, when they handed this to me, I was very impre impressed with the box as well. So it has a magnetic snap, which is I mean, for 29 bucks. Who would have expected to see that? So I did open it at the store just to make sure everything was in there, but I haven't played with it yet. Uh, but it does come with a seal here. Uh, pretty much all the same information right here on the opening slide. Let's check it out. And isn't that nice? That's a pretty cool looking knife right there. So we have a protective cover on the front. And uh, I'm not sure exactly what that tip is called right there, but it almost looks like a, like a sheep's head front but reversed. Right, so the sheep's head usually is um, at an angle in the front on the edge side. This one has it the other way around. So, nice fit. So I think that's about four inches, if I re recall correctly from the specs. This is uh, seven inches end to end. If you give me a second. Yeah, three inches on the blade, four inches on the body. Nice belt clip right there. It's very firm, got some retention to it. Um, I would imagine that that'll hold really well in a pocket. So you notice you do have two screws there, so it looks like that's removable as well. So if you prefer to have a uh, no pocket clip on there, looks like you can take it off. And uh, before I continue, let me see if there's anything else in here. It did say lanyard there. Oh, cool. Looks like we have a felt bag as well, like a storage bag. Nothing in there, but that's that's a nice touch. And there's your lanyard, so nothing special, although it's pretty thin actually. It said reflective, so I'm guessing that those um, lighter colored uh, pieces there are reflective. And it's got some information in here that doesn't come out. So information about the brand, inspired by Switzerland. So let's put that aside. Let's get back to that knife right there. And uh, again, that's a very nice size feels comfortable in the hand you know the uh, clip doesn't really get in the way that much as one would think it does on some of my other knives uh, looks like the uh, lanyard hole is actually a separate piece nice red color there be interesting to see how the edges and the uh, lanyard piece hold up to time as far as holding their colors concerned Let's see how that closes here so you do have a liner lock right here which appears to be well seated in there pretty good as far as um in place so it's not off to the not off to the side it's pretty pretty well centered there no play in the blade that's nice let's see how easy it is to close with one hand very very easy 
And yeah, that is a pretty small uh, flip knob right there. Ooh, nice. It's, that's a very, very nice uh, flip. Very easy to flip. Let me do that slow, see how it goes. Yeah, I barely pressed that and just flipped right out. So again, AUS 8 steel, titanium coating. You're gonna have the back flipper design, ceramic ball bearing, aluminum carbon fiber, fiber handle, which is gonna be your insert right there. So that's real carbon fiber, that's not a sticker. You got your lanyard hole with a reflective uh, lanyard cord that comes in the box. And this is aluminum. It didn't specify exactly what type of aluminum it is, but I tell you what, man, this is for $30. This might become my new everyday carry. That's pretty sweet looking. You got those nice curved edges as the box says, you're gonna fall in love with it. Well, I pretty much fell in love with it when I got to the store and saw it and I said, you know what, I, I've gotta have that one. Um, but let me grab a piece of paper real quick and see how sharp this knife is right out of the box. All right, so I probably should have had that ready to go, but I didn't, but let, let, let's see how she does, let's see. Oh, nice. No problem cutting through paper. I'm very curious to see how that will do with a hog or a deer. So you guys know me, I like to hunt hogs. So this one seems like it'd be nice and sharp. It'll, it'll cut through that hide pretty well. We'll see, I'll take this one to the ranch with me next time and uh, we'll see how it goes. But uh, let me look at this here. So I'm looking at the center and it looks like that blade is pretty well centered in there. As a matter of fact, let's see if you can see the, uh, and I do apologize for that background noise. That's actually my ring cam at, um, at the ranch telling me that there's motion. So not sure if you can see in there. I don't have a direct line of sight in there, but pretty well centered. It doesn't touch the sides at all. I'm looking at the other side now. And yeah, I like that. So $29.99 at Walmart, new brand that they carry. I did check online to see if other places had it for a different price and I can't find it anywhere. So I'm guessing they've got some kind of a uh, special partnership with, uh, with Walmart. And if they do, I'm looking forward to seeing what else they come out with because uh, the person that I bought it from or the person that helped me at the counter actually said that they had other Swiss Tech knives, but they were sold out. So. Looking forward to seeing what else Swiss Tech brings out. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this review. And see you next time, back at the ranch.